I'm live right now with 42,000. I'm in an app called Parallel Live that makes it look like you're live streaming with tens of thousands of people watching to see how people treat you differently when they think you're famous. Boondas, viewers. Immediately she grabbed her friends and I was an instant hit. <laughs> We then started dancing, and these women loved the live stream. They couldn't get enough of it. Oh yeah, dame mano. We then went to the nicest hotel in Medellin, Colombia, the Click Clack Hotel. Guapa. No, guapa no. Sí. Mamacita. Es linda. Mamacita. 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 The comment section is AI powered, so when it heard Spanish speakers, it started to speak in Spanish. The girls thought it had a bunch of Spanish followers. Guys, ask this question with two beautiful Colombian women. What do you guys want to know? Oh, thank you for the $40 donation. The AI donated $40. These girls couldn't believe it. One said that's more than what she makes a day. Everyone talks about being six foot tall and in six figures but I think these days all you need is attention because these women love attention you start telling them you've got a million followers and a bunch of people are watching you alive then you'll get a reaction like this and you know what they say fellas girls seek attention women seek respect word got out that I was famous and people started filming me this made the first girl mad and started grabbing on me. Even with a girl on me, people still kept coming up to me asking if they could be in my live stream. This was insane. I then went to a club where the manager saw how many viewers I had on a live stream and invited me to the VIP section. I set my live to 42,000 viewers and like a wild Charizard, this rare beauty appeared. We then started turning up on the dance floor. I felt like I was in a movie. Why does my boyfriend text his friends more than he texts me? It's less pressure. What do you mean? Texting friends is less stressful. You don't need to carefully word everything to avoid your girlfriend nitpicking it and looking for a reason to be offended. It's just easier with guys. Yeah, that's pretty true. That's true and yeah, that's true. Give me your best pickup line. If I like it, I'll go out with you on a date. No, I wouldn't want to go on a date with you. So you think I'm ugly? I don't think you're attractive. I can't, I'm not good with girls. You put me in a room with a girl is not a good idea. So you wouldn't take me home to your mom? No, I would not. Not my type. So I'm not your type. I feel like looks don't really matter to me too much. It's more It's more about personality. See, my personality sucks. No, it doesn't suck. It's more than that too. It's something about you. You can smell the only fans and lack of brain cells. <laughs> You can smell the shit from five miles away. Okay, so would you date a girl who has an OnlyFans? Hell nah. I mean date like this is your girlfriend. Like this is the one I'm introducing my mama? Hell fucking no, you crazy. But why not? Hell no, I can't take a girl with OnlyFans to my mama crib. She but she's making money, like she's she's confident. We don't care. Let me tell right, <laughs> let me tell you, we don't care. She's a ten, but she's still chatting to her apps. What is she? Fucking scab, bro. <laughs> Say I go to dinner and you invite your friends, but he okay. didn't know. Are you expecting your boyfriend to pay for all their meals? Yeah. Even though he didn't know they were coming? Me personally, yeah. Uh, I would. You yes, still want him to pay all their yes, bills? Yes, because you're a man. Like, be a man and it, pay it's, for that. It's like a way of respecting. You're yes. respecting them in that but kind of way. But what if he says, like, no, I don't want to pay for their bills because like, you didn't tell me in advance? Then don't come out with us. Like, no, why would you come no. out? It was like y'all think, but you brought them last minute. Still, you want him to pay for it? Hell no. Look at the Asian girl's reaction, who's also the prettiest one and not going to end up with cats. It says it all. Man, like, be a man and it, pay for it's that. Like you I got my kids on babysitter. I got the babysitter and shit. $40 tonight. I got a mom tonight. Hey, I got a mom too. Uh huh. Give me a little spin. <laughs> hey, mom, what will you rate yourself? I got two kids, huh? What will you rate yourself, mom? Though? A 10. 10? A 10. Why, you, why do you a call 10. yourself a 10? Because I'm a 10. You're a Why do you think that? What do you mean? Why do you think that? Because of my personality. Well, I'll give you about Listen. a six. What the f Bitch, you're shorter than me. What the f you give me a six for? If you're taller than me, maybe you give me a six. The f you ain't give me a fucking six. She's got the cat ears on, she's manifesting her future because if she attacks a man for his height every time he tells her what she don't want to hear, it's only going one way. Cat lady. If you woke up as a female, what's the first thing you're doing? Start bitching. <laughs> You start bitching? Start complaining? Yeah, I do. To who? To anybody who's standing there. Anybody who's standing there. Africans, Americans, Dominicans, Mexicans. Anybody can get it. Okay, great. Do you see that? If you date a guy like that, yeah, you're never going to have clothes because he's always going to be wearing them. So you, we, not... That's not the, that's the weird, weirdo, weirdo guy. Not a drop of masculinity in that guy, is it? Imagine if your daughter brings home this muppet. You'd just be thinking, how's he gonna protect her? If something goes down, what is he gonna do? He'll do fucking nothing. My husband doesn't care that I have literally been inside there before. 
I don't say that every time I see a picture of you on the wall now, do I? What did he say? I make more than a doctor and I capitalize off of men. You guys are my biggest fans, even if you're haters. I made over $400,000 last year and it is all because of you. If you guys just came together as a whole, as men, we wouldn't be in business. We are profiting off of you. Thank you. And I'm about to be out in a million this year, so keep it up. You might not like it, but she's not wrong. It's men that pay for OnlyFans. It's men that are putting money in these women's pockets. If men stop being so stupid and stop simping, then this shit wouldn't even exist. What red flags do you like in a guy? When he doesn't want me. I'm like obsessed. If he doesn't want me, I'm like, yes, you're mine. So you like the chase? I love I the chase. Toxic. <laughs> if he also hangs out with other girls, but likes me more than them. He likes someone else. Hey, what's Alcoholic, that? controlling, asshole. So you like toxic relationships? Oh, absolutely. Red is my favorite color. Toxic or boring relationships? To toxic. Toxic. Toxic, like, toxic for sure. I want to be crying. Like, keep me on my toes. Like, it's entertaining. <laughs> a woman who seeks a toxic bum will usually end up a single mum. That's called motherfucking boys. Hi, I'm Kiko. I'm 23. Uh, I go to UCSB and I also bartend. My name is Optimus Prime. We are autonomous. <laughs> <laughs>They've probably been going to that same spot for years and they're sat there now thinking, What the fuck is going on there? It's our first official dinner in Greece. I'm wearing this teeny tiny dress and I just feel like I'm gonna get a lot of eyes. My um, eyes. That would be ideal, but a lot of other eyes. She just exposed herself and said what she's really thinking. She don't give a shit about him looking. She wants other people to look. And if she does this type of shit, she doesn't care about you. She don't give a fuck. What's y'all's type? Anybody who makes money. We talk about appearance. You can't do that. Anybody who's pretty and makes money. Okay, right. What's your age? I'm 24. 24. What's the most challenging thing about dating 24-year-old men? They don't have any money. <laughs> they don't. No aspirations, no money and no will to provide. So you're not attracted to men without money? It's really hard to date without money because I like to go out and do things. Yeah, I agree. Um, nails, hair, drinks, stuff like that. So it's a man's job to pay for your nails and your hair? Yes, just like it's my job to look like this. That's right. But I thought women did makeup and their hair and their nails for themselves, not for men. Yes, but as you're a woman, you want your woman to look Beautiful. If your woman looks like a bum, that's on you. Yeah. So if we were dating from the jump, you'd expect me to start paying for your hair and your nails? From the jump. From the jump. And how much would I be spending? A cool 500 a week. <laughs> Easy. Nails and toes, uh, 200. And then hair, salon, makeup, maintenance, all that good stuff, highlight, 200. So the man pays for all your hair and your makeup and stuff. What does he get in return? Me. <laughs> Me looking good for you. You can walk around with me. You get a bad attitude, headaches, and an empty wallet. Not even the cats are going to want these two donuts. Have you guys ever cheated? I cheated on my last boyfriend like 75 times. He was broke as <laughs> My new man, he would never. He got money. He a plug. He for sure be taking care of me. If she cheats, she belongs to the streets.